What is up gamers and haters and welcome back to Twisted Big Gaming. I'm the Twisted Big Gamer and today you're joining me for another Roulette Tuesday. Today I have chosen to play some Deadstone. I was given this game by the creator, uh, which all his links and the link for this game will be in the description below. And as well, if you get the game, you can obviously see the Facebook link and the forum for them guys. So we're going to go ahead and start a one player game. And we're going to go ahead and do the campaign. And I've already started this and played a little bit of it so that I knew what I was doing. But we're going to go ahead and start a new one today. Yes, we'll start a new one. I really like this game. Um, for being an indie game, it's really, really uh, got a good story and everything else. Um, and the graphics are just really, really good too. Um, it's kind of the god mode sort of view. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and try to skip past a lot of this here. Um, you guys, if you want to see this, uh, definitely go get the game and get into the story some. I just really want to get into the gameplay and show you guys that. Um, okay, pick a sto side A or side B or no story. Um, let's see, experience Deadstone's campaign and storyline, experience or Farkle's take on the storyline. I think we're just going to go ahead and um, stick with the original here. Um, we'll leave the tutorials, oh, let's see, uh, I'll leave them on, and uh, Tiger's, uh, you were allowed to reset after finally, we'll go ahead and leave that on too. Day zero, Mars time. So yeah, the concept here pretty much is that... The world um, of Mars has been taken over by these aliens. Okay, you're not going to like this. Uh, does it involve kittens? We'll go ahead and go with casual just because I'm really not used to the game just yet. Uh, eventually, I'll probably step that up. Um, but if you guys want to see this become a mini series on the channel, uh, let me know in the comments below of this video. And I'd definitely be interested in doing that. I'm kind of looking for a game that you guys would like to see me do all the way through. Um, there's I could do games for hours, so there's like several that I could do um, And if you guys want a list of the games that I have just let me know in the comments below and I will give you guys that as well All right, so it's the simple W S A D keys um, Left shift to sprint rotate mount is by using the mouse here um, My mini map there my health bar and all that stuff and my weapon And you shoot by just pushing the left mouse button there okay shoot the training dummy and now I can go ahead and skip forward into the story here and pretty much what's gonna happen is is it's gonna give me my first little wave here um, and my friend Caleb games has played this and played the survival mode and that's kind of really really interesting it's pretty much like zombies on black ops if you like that kind of thing only obviously from this um, god mode kind of view and I think it's really nice too that the mini map down here shows you where the enemies are and where they're going to be coming from. That way you're really not kind of getting overwhelmed. It does get really difficult though. I've not died in my other save, but, um, well now I guess I don't have the other save, but I've not died in that and uh, I've made it pretty far. So it's it's kind of challenging, but that's also because, it, you know, there, if you, you got to take everything into account, you know, there's all kinds of different weapons and things like that to unlock and you really got to know which ones will work the best. Because you'd think that there's some that would work and they just really kind of don't. Ah. So as far as complaints for this game, I really don't have any. I think it's entertaining. I could probably sit and spend all day playing this. Um, oh crap. The controls are pretty simple. The object of the game is pretty simple. Um, I guess it'd be cool to kind of maybe add a little bit more into it mission-wise. That'd be the only thing I could think of instead of it having just kind of this whole survival thing. Because that can kind of get... I don't know. In my opinion, it gets repetitive and so it gets kind of boring. But... Um, I don't know yet. Obviously, I've not made it far enough in to actually know that for sure. But that was the first chapter of this, guys. Oh, real fast, too. Uh, you get to level up your character, too. That's something else that's really, really neat. Um, and, I mean, it gets into detail. So if you're one of those players that likes to actually have a unique individual character, this is the game to play. Um, but if you guys want to see more of this, let me know in the comments below. If you liked it, don't forget to click that like button. And if you want to see more, also click that subscribe button. Talk to you guys later. Peace.